What's going on YouTube? Today we are back with another banger. Today we have another pair of hair sevens. We did a pair of these before, but it, was just, it wasn't a full restoration. These are going to be a full restoration. We're going to be fixing the paint, shoelaces, your new buck, and yellowing, detailing the soles, um, repainting the midsole. It's going to be a lot. So it took me like literally an hour to loosen up the laces because they were knotted, as you can see right there. A little bit here but i got it done so i'm just going to go ahead and remove the laces and once we do that we're going to put these in a solution with rejuvenator and some bleach to soak and that should just help clean up the laces and whiten them as well because they're pretty much gray at this point all right now we've got the laces removed i'm going to go ahead start with my medium brush and just go ahead and give these a nice cleaning Okay, so now that I've got the uppers cleaned up, I'm going to use my stiff texture brush to clean the midsole and the outsole. Alright, so we got everything nice and cleaned up. As you can see, the shoe's a lot brighter and wider. Um, once everything dries, we're going to go ahead, we're going to do a detail of the outsoles, and then we're going to go ahead and do the unyellowing and then we move on from there. All right guys, now that I've got the midsole taped up from the uppers, I'm just gonna go ahead and use a cotton round and some leather deglazer, and I'm just gonna go ahead and start to remove all of the factory paint off the midsole, just so that I can get a fresh start and make everything nice and clean again. So at this point, I'm just using acetone and cotton rounds to just remove all the marks from the uppers of the shoe, like that pen mark. The light is really on there. Oh, like this pen mark I'm just gonna use the cotton rounds and acetone to just get that out the way these scuffs over here I'm gonna do the same thing for that okay so at this point I'm just gonna be taping up the midsole of the shoes just so we go ahead and get a clean repaint on them so I'm just using regular um, scotch tape so now that I've got the midsoles taped up as you can see I got everything completely taped up I'm just gonna be using some Angelus white paint and I'm going to start from this side and I'm just going to make my way around the midsole. So at this point, I'm going to go ahead and start to sand down these cracks in the leather. I'm going to start with some 2000 grit, and if I need to, I'm going to just make my way down. So like these areas, like right here, over here, I'm just going to sand that down so that I can repaint it. stuffed the shoes with plastic bags just to fill out the shape of the shoe and I'm just going to be using an iron around this towel not to take the creases out but just to reshape the shoe in general the shoes are pretty deformed so I'm just doing this to reshape the sneakers obviously it's not going to like completely bring them back to dead stock shape but it is going to relieve some of the um, creases out okay so I'm going to be using a magic eraser to go ahead and get rid of all the scratches and marks on the yellow rubber before I go ahead and start to unravel it. Okay, so now that I've got that cleaned up, I'm gonna go ahead and start to acetone and clean out the holes in the soles. So I'll go ahead and unravel this as well.
All right, guys, as you can see, the shoes are completely finished. We started off with a really beat pair of Hair 7s, and we brought these back to a good condition. They're now wearable again. You know what I'm saying? There was a lot of rough edges where the glue was, so the paint job wasn't perfect. It was hard to get around that. Soles were iced and everything. But they look pretty nice now. They look, they're good and wearable. And that was the gold. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.